Indonesia has unveiled its intentions to procure at least two Airbus A330 multi-role tanker transports MRTTs, in order to bolster its aerial refueling capabilities. The Indonesian Air Force TNIU, seeks to enhance its operational flexibility with these new aircraft, as it readies itself for the integration of new combat aircraft, including 42 Rafales and 24 F-15E-S, into its existing fleet. This decision was made public following a meeting between Indonesia's Deputy Defense Minister, Mr. Harindra, and Anand Stanley, Airbus's Director for the Indo-Pacific Region, on September 5, 2023. As per a statement from the Indonesian Defense Ministry, the A330 MRTT will complement other Airbus defense equipment already contracted by the government, such as the AS-565 MBE Panther anti-submarine helicopters, H-225M transport helicopters, and A-400M cargo planes. Although the ministry's statement appeared to hint at the existence of a contract, an Airbus spokesperson informed Jane's that they are in the process of finalizing the details after Indonesia's announcement. While the precise number of A330 MRTTs to be acquired was not explicitly specified, reports from specialized Indonesian media suggest that the country is likely to purchase two of these aircraft. The A330 MRTT boasts the capability to transfer up to 50 tons of fuel across a range of 2,000 kilometers, with a 4.5-hour on-station time. It can also transport 40 tons of cargo over a distance of 7,000 kilometers and can accommodate as many as 272 passengers. This aircraft has recently been selected by Canada and Brazil, with South Korea also contemplating an order for two more. This acquisition holds significance for Indonesia, which is tasked with monitoring and safeguarding an expanse of one. 905 million square kilometers, encompassing numerous archipelagos, some of which are subject to territorial disputes with China. Presently, Indonesia's aerial refueling capabilities are limited to 1 KC, 130B Hercules, soon to be complemented by 2 A400M Atlas planes.